He brings to the table two medical specialties, including a degree in homeopathic medicine. In fact, he studied in Greece and Belgium under the number one homeopathic physician in the world. He's smart as a whip and uh, quickly understood that this product was a winner. So Scott Stansfield, good evening. Please come out and tell our audience why you're here with New You Life and what you know for sure about our Somaderm product. Good evening. Thank you so much, Jeannie. The basic reason I'm here is I would be incredibly foolish not to be. No, I have a, I have a wonderful background in this industry, as Jeannie says. It's been very good, very good to me, but I had retired from the marketing industry, oh, for probably 13, 14 years, uh, only because there wasn't a lot out there that I could get really passionate about and excited about. Everything was kind of a me too thing. And all of a sudden, uh, Alexi puts out a product that is just a game changer. Now, if you're hearing about HGH for the first time, uh, that's a wonderful thing. It will probably very shortly become one of your favorite subjects. The nice thing about HGH is it's not new. It's been around since actually the 20s. They started using it on human beings in the late 50s. It uh, started being used continuously in the 60s. There are 30,000 plus peer-reviewed medical studies on HGH. National Library of Medicine, National Institutes of Health, uh, PubMed.gov, Center for Disease Control, uh, Harvard, Wharton, Cornell, whatever your UCLA, whatever your medical school is, not only within this country, but all over the world, HEH has been studied. Now, what does that mean to you? That means we don't need to figure out if it works. As a matter of fact, uh, I always joke, Einstein was a pretty sharp guy, and he said one of the definitions of insanity, and we, we've all heard it before, uh, is that take something that's that's uh, not worked over and over and over and over and over again and somehow magically expect it's going to work when you use it. Okay, well, there's a flip side to that same thing. Take something that's been around for decades that has worked repeatedly with millions upon millions of people all over the world and somehow assume it won't work for you. That's just as crazy. So what is New Life's homeopathic somaderm gel? Well, first of all, it's the only transdermal. What does that mean? It means it goes on right through the skin, put it in the thin area of your skin. It's the only transdermal FDA-registered human growth hormone uh, product available without a prescription anywhere on earth, on earth. The benefits of HGH are off the charts. Now, there's about 20 different uh, botanicals in HGH, but the active ingredients, there are three. There's glandular suprinalysis, okay, 6X, thyroidinium, 8X, and somatrophin, 30X. Now, when you hear those, you hear the X behind it. That indicates it's a homeopathic preparation. So, what is a homeopathic preparation, and exactly how does that work? Well, Homeopathic medicine has actually been around far longer than our Western medicine. It's accepted all over the world. It is used in the U.S., not nearly as much because we have a huge industry around the pharmaceutical industry here. But in Europe, for example, in Russia, in China, and in most of India, uh, homeopathic medicine rivals ours. As a matter of fact, if you go over to England, the royal family over there, they don't have a physician. They have a homeopath on staff, too, as a matter of fact. So homeopathy is tried and true. It's a proven science, and it works very, very well virtually every single time. Now, what makes homeopathic medicine so different? Well, it operates in what's called the law of similars. Now, how that works is this. Let's assume you come to me, and you say, I have itching, burning, tearing eyes. My nose is all stopped up. My allergies are just really, really giving me a hard time. You ladies know that if you cut an onion in the kitchen, you can get itchy, watery, teary, burning eyes and a stuffed up nose real quickly. So as a homeopathic physician, if you came to me with that problem, and there's a reason I'm telling you about this, so hang with me here. If you came, with me, uh, came to me with that problem, this allergy problem, I'm going to give you a little dose of Allium Cepa Extra. It's an incredibly powerful red French onion. That onion is so powerful, you cut that thing halfway through, I'll tell you what, your eyes will burn, they'll tear, uh, your, your nose will water. But the interesting thing with homeopathic medicines and homeopathic remedies is if I give you a microscopic dose, a minimal dose of the same thing that would cause that problem in a healthy person, 
it will reverse it. So when you come to me with your allergies, I give you a microscopic little tiny dose of that French onion, and boom, all of a sudden, your allergies start to go away. It does just the opposite. So why is that important for us, and why is that important when you look at a product that's a homeopathic product? Well, first of all, why are we taking the product? We're taking the product because for most people, their HGH levels have basically bottomed. Now, HGH starts, it was put in, put in your body uh, as, a, as a requirement by your creator. Uh, it's a product of the pituitary gland, and interestingly enough, once it's made, it actually runs the pituitary gland. We can call the pituitary the master gland. HGH is the captain of the ship. The HGH levels start when you're very small, when you're an infant, and they gradually rise and rise and rise like a bell curve. They peak when you hit, oh, 20, 21, 21 and a half years of age. And at that point, they start going down. Now, why is that important? Well, by the time you're 40, about 80% of your HGH is already gone. By the time you're 50, almost all your HGH is gone. I want you to think about something for a minute. When do almost all the disease problems in this country start to occur? Let me give you a hint, 45 to 50. Why is that? Among other things, because your HGH levels have dropped or bottomed out. When the HGH levels drop or bottom out, it doesn't regulate the pituitary, and the pituitary controls, uh, controls everything from weight gain to glandular functions to hormone functions. The women start having issues. The men start having issues. You can't sleep at night. You can't focus. Uh, the memory's a little foggy and cloudy. Uh, you can't remember where you're going or what you're doing. Uh, the hair starts uh, changing color, if not falling out entirely. All kinds of things start to happen, you know, hot flashes. Now, we don't have hot flashes in my house. My wife has told me they are not hot flashes. They are, in fact, power surges. There's a difference, apparently. So all those things start to happen when the HGH levels start to disappear. Now, how do you replace HGH? Well, you've had a couple options. Here's the first one. You can go to a very expensive specialist. You can spend four or $500 on, a, uh, on, on appointments. Then you can do some very, very expensive blood work. And then you can take and poke yourself with a needle in the abdomen twice a day at a cost of between $2,200 to $3,300 a month. Now, if that doesn't sound too appealing, it may not be appealing to you, but let me tell you something. It's appealing to the Yay-listers, to the celebrities in Hollywood, celebrities like Tom Cruise, who uh, heading toward his mid-60s looks 20 years younger than his co-star, who in fact is 20 years younger than he is. So the celebrities and the A-listers uh, you know, the, the athletes, they've known about this a long time. They're willing to pay that price. For the average individual, probably not worth it, and it doesn't make a lot of sense. Now, what's option B if you don't want to poke yourself with a needle? Well, option B is you take a pill. Well, that sounds a lot simpler, and the truth of the matter is it is. Now, the pill is also very, very expensive, not as expensive as the injections, but very, very pricey. Now, the problem with a pill is both the pill and the injections have side effects. A homeopathic remedy never, never has a side effect. So you don't need to worry about side effects. You don't need to worry about if it's going to get in the way of something else. Here's the bottom line. It's not. But the pill, unfortunately, has to be taken on an empty stomach or it's not effective. Now, when I say an empty stomach, I don't mean you stop eating two minutes before you take the pill. <clears throat> what I mean is you fast for ideally three hours, minimum two and a half hours before you take the pill, then you take the pill, and you fast for two and a half to three hours afterwards. Now, I don't know about your lifestyle, but mine does not permit a six-hour fast to take a pill every single day. That just simply does not work for me. And the truth of the matter is, it doesn't work for most people. So what's option number three? Well, there wasn't an option number three until Alexi Goldstein came up with this. And I want you to know the product we're talking about tonight is not new. It's been around 14 and a half years. He first put, put it together for athletes, for power lifters, for MMA, uh, you know, martial arts superstars, and then it started spreading. It went to the skincare clinics. It went to the plastic surgeons. Uh, it went to the people, the, you know, the rejuvenation clinics. It went absolutely nuts. And it went nuts for about 14 and a half years. So we don't need to figure out if this works. It's got a huge, huge history behind it. And we get to benefit from it for the very first time in a form that does not require a prescription, that does not require injections or pills. You take a little drop the size of a pea, you put it on, 
once in the morning, once at night, rub it on your inner arm and uh, your, your wrist and, and watch what happens. Well, here's what most people experience in just the first month. They've got improved stamina. The energy level goes off the charts. Your sleeping goes absolutely nuts. You've got vivid dreams. Uh, you know, starting about the second month, the muscle definition starts to improve. Now, these can, these can change orders depending on the individual. Heightened libido, we all know what that means. We don't need purple pills, perhaps. Skin gets healthier. Strength gets much, much, uh, you know, much increase uh, in, in strength. You start to get weight loss. You get that little roll around the center of, your, center of your belly there that no matter how many crunches or exercise you do, you just can't seem to get rid of that little roll. That starts to go away. Uh, about month three, you know, uh, hair starts growing back in many, many cases. Uh, definitely enhanced muscle mass, uh, greater flexibility. You've got joint mobility. Uh, you know, menopausal symptoms start coming, coming down, the, uh, down the road. By the time you get down to month five, you're starting to get significant weight loss in many cases. Skin texture and appearance, it's got greater elasticity. Uh, wrinkles start to start to go away. Hair becomes thicker and healthy. And it, it just builds. It builds and builds and builds. So this is a fantastic product. The fact that we have this product, no one else has this product. No one else can get this product. And it's the only product available in this form anywhere on earth. What an incredible, incredible opportunity for us. So is it safe? Yes, it's incredibly, incredibly safe. Now, you'll see on the bottle that it says synthetic HDH, and I want to explain that for two minutes before I leave. When we talk about synthetic, our concept of synthetic is some guy made it in a laboratory with a bunch of chemicals and, and this kind of stuff, and it's not really good for you. And for most cases, that definition is incredibly accurate, but it does not apply here. And the reason for that, when HDH first came out, it was synthesized from cadavers. It was synthesized from human cadavers and from animal cadavers. And for those of you that don't know what a cadaver is, it's a dead person. The problem is, along with that, they started seeing over time problems with the HGH that originated in that source because they didn't know what the cadaver had had prior to that. So the FDA formed a ruling and they said, you can no longer make natural HGH the way natural HGH is made. You have to call it synthetic HGH. Now, synthetic HGH comes from a bovine extract. It's a cow. It's the red wagyu cattle in Australia. It's specially designed just for this. It's incredibly effective. So until we, come, until we find a way to make synthetic cows or synthetic plants, you need to understand this is all natural. It has to be labeled synthetic by the government. We don't have a choice. But synthetic does not mean man-made because man doesn't make cows and man doesn't make plants. It's a wonderful product. You'll have a lot of fun with it. Uh, I've been on the product. I had to wait like everybody else. I've been on the product for two weeks. And, oh, my goodness, I'll tell you what. I, I, I'm on this product. I don't care if there were ever an opportunity attached to it, if they never marketed this product via direct sales, which we're blessed to have, I'll be on this product for the rest of my life. It is unbelievable. And if you don't believe in HGH, it's okay. If you don't understand it, it's okay. If you don't know how it works, it's okay. Because it's going to work with or without your permission, whether you understand it or not, whether you understand the ingredients in the bottle, it makes no difference. If you put it in your system, it will work, period. End of story. I'm excited to be a part of this, very excited to have access to this product. Just that alone gets me excited.